to go uh, get school supplies for school. And school supplies like elephant food and no. stuff like that. Supplies you need to use for school. Like like a car. No. I don't need a car to go to school because I'm homeschooled. Oh, so so a computer? Well, school provides me with that, like stuff like pencils and pencil cases and markers. I have a list right here and a calculator. Awesome, awesome. Well, let's jump to it then. Yeah! Into the thick of it! Into the thick of it! Okay, first on our list we have pencils, markers, erasers, crayons, glue stick, glue bottle, ink, paper 18 inch to 24 inch, paper 9 inch to 20 to 12 inch, colored paper, white paper, scissors, pro protractor, clipboard, pencil case, art sketchbook, multi-purpose, calculator, ruler, colored pencil, shoes, underwear, and coat. Crayons. Now, should I get the big box or the little box? The big box is cheaper. Well, it's expensive, but- <laughs> The big box is cheaper. But it's got more and it's not much expensive. Plus, you can always look at this number. Usually the, the tags will tell you how much like the like the prices. That wouldn't tell you per ounce, so that would be dumb. <laughs> uh, I got six six and a half ounces of crayon. Why is it more expensive? It's because it's not in the right place. Let's this one. All right, so what you got? I got this big pack of crayons. And you decided to go with the big pack instead today, huh? Uh huh. Because then I had more of a color choice. Ooh, colored boost. I was just seeing that. Another scented. Ooh, it smells. Oh. I'm getting chocolate brownie. Chocolate brownie Water glue brownie. sticks. They have sugar cookie, blueberry muffin, mango pineapple, I watermelon, and apple pie. Okay. All right, now you're not supposed to be eating these. I was just gonna say that. Is this supposed to, like, how are they gonna deter kids from eating these? $79. I'm baiting on what markers I have. There's a lot of washing. Does it look good? Mm -hmm. Erase them? Oh, I'm getting old. I didn't even know they made these. Dang, when I saw that, I'm like, that's mine. That is mine. Erasable. Not I'm checking to see if they have erasers on them. Ew. That is so cool. It's an erasable color pencil. I love cool. that. I need a package of these. I'm making myself a mental list. <laughs> okay. So now we're at seventy-three dollars. And what's next? Uh, next up, we also need erasers. Ooh, bottles of glue, we need that. Hey, mommy also found something else for you. <gasps> you found a uh, protractor, I need that. Is that the color you want? Because they've also got green and blue. Is that pink or black? Found a white one. Ooh, white one would be my favorite if that's the only other color. Well, I'll take white then. Ooh. I got a protractor. Okay, we also need a bottle of glue. Should I get like this size or this size? I don't know. Are you planning on eating it or just using it for art projects? I would say get both. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> how much glue we use at our house? We need that thing. Okay, how much yep, that's all because of Diva. Protractor. One ninety-seven. I'm not kidding. A protractor? No, the big bottle of glue. Oh. One forty-four. Which means that these don't go here. Oh, they go here. And it says printed blue, which means that they are all together, probably all. But blue. that's okay. I just need one that it, it works. And it's my kind of scissors. 
So mine is 140. 147. Yes! Why do I always say that? Like that. Whoa! I doubt there's gonna be ink in here. I love how they just stash these, like on the shelf with all the really cheap stuff. Um, they're hoping somebody's gonna just grab them. Yeah, they're like 20 bucks. Yeah, it's Prismacolor. Colored paper. That's construction paper. Is that the kind of colored paper you were talking about? I have no idea. She literally just said colored paper. Then that would be it. <laughs> I also need normal, like, printer paper. Well, we've got tons of printer paper at home. Okay, um, we also need two specific sizes of paper. An 18 by 24 and a 9 by 12. Hmm. These are 9 by 12. 18 by 24 is the normal. 9 by 11. Or 8 and a half. 8 and a half by 11 is your normal. Right, I was like, wait, that's not right. But this is like a paint pad right here, and it's nine and nine by twelve. The other size sounds really big. Yeah, I don't know what you would use that for. Like for art projects, maybe like they're really big. Yeah. Yeah. We might have to find those in like the art room. Yeah, we can go over there. But let's see if there's anything else here we need. Oh, the what pencil else? cases. What else is on your list? You need pencils. Do you need notebooks? For notebooks. Um, what about a binder? Yeah, I. Like a. Uh, a trapper keeper? I need some notebooks to take notes in. I'm getting two, one for uh, social studies and the other one for science, because those are the two I usually need to take notes in. Oh. Look at those. That looks cool. Those protractors look fancy. Fancy yeah. smancy. Oh, this is the calculator I want. What is it, what is it? It's a, um, it's a TI-30XIIS. All oh, right, sounds good, sounds good. It was like $7,000, right? No. <laughs> there was a calculator that was $100, but that was a lot. That would be just a little bit too much, don't you think? That's my whole budget for all my school supplies. <clears throat> oh yes, I'm just gonna spend my whole budget on a calculator. <laughs> I got a calculator, I'm good for school now. Seven. So expensive, huh? So expensive. It's the most expensive thing I've bought in so far. Ah! Because you didn't buy a gallon of glue. Hmm. I need a pencil case. All right. What pencil case are you getting? I like this one. I could put it in a binder too. It's yeah. super pretty. It is pretty. And that is. Holy shnikes. Do I really want that? What? Ten dollars! That's that's a choice you have to make. No! I only have fifty bucks left. Can't do that. This is what we mean by prioritizing. Mm -hmm. See, you got other ones down here that are three ninety seven yeah. as opposed to eleven dollars. <laughs> like this one and it's got more room and it's only four bucks. And it's all fuzzies. And it's cheetah print. I love cheetah print. I know you love cheetah prints. Oh, it's bad. It better not be. It's more expensive than that. Never mind. It's more expensive than the first one I wanted. 12 bucks. Who pays 12 bucks for a pencil case? Not me. Mechanical, because I'm a mechanical girl. Yeah, I was always a mechanical person, too. I like these, because they're really nice. Oh, and there's so many. There's so many. That's 546, and it's worth it. It's a 50 count of mechanical pencils. That's mine. You also need erasers, which I saw in here. You saw erasers? Hmm. What was that? My funky walk. Looked like an old grandpa walk going on there. No, it's like it's called the I'm funky just, walk. I'm just an old person over here trying to get around. So I do have to pay three dollars for two erasers. Yes, you do. Three sixty-nine. Um, that was really wrong. Ninety-seven. <laughs> Three sixty-nine. Oh wait, it's ninety-seven. Where did you get the six from? 
I'm just making numbers up now. What? What? Did you clear everything? Uh-huh. Look. So 46, 47 is what you were at before this. Oh, thank you. I was like, oh no. Oh no. I still like that one more though. <laughs> yeah. That one Animal Crossing's pretty cool though, huh? Yeah, I love Animal Crossing. That's the wrong song. <laughs> I love games, so this is one. Hey, baby, baby, baby. Now I gotta go put put it in the numbers. Three point ninety eight. Three eight fifty two left. I also need a ruler, which will probably be in this section. And that looks like it that for this section area. Hey, up here. Rulers. Moves there. Mm, mm, mm. Pretty. A pity ruler. It's so pretty. There's also wooden ones up here. Or they've got the slap band kind. Uh, they're not slap bands. That's just how they look. Oh. It's just a ruler. They look like a slap band. It did kind of look like a slap band, didn't it? Oh, those are like sick erasers. The world's best erasers. They're probably like ten dollars. <laughs> just like how pencil case is twelve dollars. Okay, now let's go to the art section. Did you subtract art. off your ruler? Oh yeah, right. <laughs> Ninety-seven cents. Oh. So expensive. I forgot when I subtract cents, I have to go zero point. Yes, zero point. Zero point. If we were on Stargate, we'd be talking about zero point modules. We're gonna start heading toward the art section to get paper and ink. Art section, huh? Yeah. You wanna leave me? Yeah. With more of your scented glue sticks. And if you guys didn't know before, I have loved cheetah print ever since I was in second grade. See, I got a cheetah print pencil case, and I got a cheetah print clipboard, because I think it's pretty. I just noticed that like all my stuff like doesn't match. <laughs> but it's all things I like, like cheetah print, gaming, colorful. I guess these match too. But it's funny how like none of my stuff matches, but they're all me. Yeah. Yeah. This one's 22 inches. 22 inches, yay! But it's not a piece of paper. I mean, it's post board, and I'm pretty sure it's got like a sticker. Oh, well, that's not what we're looking for. Let's go look at the clothes now for shoes. Oh, his shoes. Shiny. I actually like the shiny shoes. Shiny shoes. The most adorable shoes ever, and I want them, but they're... They're adorbs? Yeah. Those are super cute. Are these the same? I don't think these will fit you, biddies. Yeah. These. Really? These don't even look like oh, they really? would fit Diva. Oh, really? These, they might fit Diva. No, no. Diva's feet are a lot bigger than these. Yeah. Looks like those fours are the biggest ones they have. Well, those are not their shoes! They got cheetah print and they're black and they're sneakers. It's like me. <laughs> hey look, these have cheetah prints on them. Of course, I don't know if you like those colors, but. It's a hard choice when it comes to shoes. It's a hard choice when it comes to shoes. Those are tens. Is there anything smaller than that? There's, Tyler, there's, I a, find, there's a 12 back there. Well, now you see you're on the adulty, more adulty area. It's either I find shoes too small or too big. It's not fun. I don't see any sixes. Six, right? Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. That is kind of cool. I like that. And look at the digital print on the bottom of the shoe. Yeah. Isn't that cool? You 
do not have to pick shoes that you don't like just to get shoes. Yes. It's much better to go to a different Walmart at a different time in a different universe. See what happens when we bring Sapphire? There are sixes. Sa Mine! Sa Sapphire's like, I'm going to take all of the shoes. Those are super cute. I still I want, want to see if there's anything that actually fits me that like, like, cool. <gasps> I'm, I'm really confused. How, uh, all right, look at this. Look, 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 look. Bitties, right? Size six, right? I'm gonna set this here for a second. All right? <laughs> Don't get me started. Size 13s. That's for kids. No, 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 no. Why? Why? Why would they call them different sizes? I could tell you that's, why. You that's why? Crazy Mage's size of shoe. It's because they start at zero or one for infants, and then they work their way up to 13. That's Crazy Mage's size of shoe. And then they switch from toddlers to kids' shoes, and they start over at one at kids' shoes. So Crazy Mage just went from wearing a 13, now he's wearing ones. Which is really odd. Because he's no longer you know, you know how they should do it? The inch size of the foot. Like by how big your shoes like. Uh huh. If your foot is three inches long, then you wear size threes. Yeah, that would make way more sense. If your foot is 12 inches long, you wear size 12s. Do you like those shiny? Not cool size 70. I love how she's just oh. like. Those are cute too. I like the stretchy backs on these. And look at the look at the pattern on the on the yeah, foot that's what on the bottom. Caught my attention. I'm like, Ugh. The rainbow patterns on the bottom. Yeah, isn't they cool? And there's so many cute sneakers. These are my favorite shoes. Look how dirty they are compared to the new. They're either too big or too small. I found the shoes I want. Here I have, those are the hey. shoes I have. I just found out about this the other day. Okay. I don't know why that's stuck on there. Look, anyways, feel the bottoms of these and tell me what you feel, guys. Sandpaper. This feels weird, I don't like that. Do you, like know, you know what that is? What? It has to do with taxes. Taxes? Yes. I pay my when, taxes. No, 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 no. When shoes are sent over here, they're, they're imported. Shoes are taxed at a lot higher percentage uh -huh. than slippers are. But slippers have to have cloth covering 70% or more of the bottom of their foot. So these places will put a thin layer of cloth that will wear off after you start walking on it. And it classifies them as a slipper and not as a shoe for tax purposes. Now, to properly see, you have to stand up and try to walk on it. I mean, they're not as comfy as these, but of course I also need to break them in. Yeah. Like, they felt as they feel as, about as comfortable as these were when I first bought them. <laughs> Toesy socks. They keep your feet extra warm. And now the shoe is all warm too. <laughs> so you found what you wanted? Yeah, I found the shoes I want. Sweet. How do you think you did? Really good. So, if you had one item that you were really happy that you got today, what was it? Um, probably my pencil case. 
Do you like that pencil case, Steve? Very pretty. That was a really cool pencil case. Yeah. Sweet. 